Welcome to A Cup of Joe with Binko. My name is Kay Hupp and I will be your Binko host for today. The purpose of A Cup of Joe with Binko is to give you a lot of information in a very small amount of time about Binko's service or product. And today I have one of my really good friends on that I'm super excited about, Linda Anderson. Hello, Linda. Hi, Kay. Thank you so much for asking me to join you on the Cup of Joe with Benko. Coffee is my favorite. I am so honored that you're on with me, Linda. Now, Linda, tell me a little bit about what you do for Benko or what you've done for Benko. Oh, great question. I have been a Benko practice management coach and trainer for many years, multiple years, Kay, as you know, for a long time, and um, totally have enjoyed traveling the country, working with uh, dental practices that want to um, support with their systems, they want to do what better, they want to increase their goals, all different aspects of what they can do um, in a dental practice. So, and now today we're going to talk about the revenue analysis consultation, because it sounds like that, you know, this year you've kind of gone a lot virtual, virtual, if I'm not mistaken. Is that correct, Linda? Yes, uh, we've done a major pivot. We're now offering virtual training and it's going quite well. So tell me, we're going to talk about the revenue analysis consultation that I know you've done some of those also. So tell me, what is it? Why is it important and who should do it? Okay, so great question again. So the revenue analysis consultation is a deeper dive to look into the doctor's uh, fees that they're charging in their practice as usual and customary. So I think that any doctor that is considering, um, first of all, if they haven't looked at their fees for a few years, they should be looking at them because uh, the operating costs have definitely increased, especially last year. But also a doctor, if they're considering buying new equipment, if they want to expand their office, they should be definitely looking at their fees as a way to increase revenue to support doing those improvements within their practice, Um, especially before they do it so that the patients don't feel that, oh, all of a sudden the fees have gone up because we have a new office. So before they do these kinds of changes is a great time to look at their, their revenue. And it is something that they should also do together as a team, correct, Linda? Correct. I think the team needs to be on board. They need to also understand that an increase in revenue also helps them with an increase in maybe a wage or something. So raises, all those kinds of things are things that a doctor needs to look at and looking at their fees helps that. And you also give them some good verbal skills. Am I correct, Linda? Yes. um, There's lots of times when a team doesn't know how to explain the raise or the cost of the the increase in fee. So I like to give them some little tips on that as well. Fantastic. Now, and who do you use to uh, gather the information with? Like, what, What company do you work with? So we use the National Dental Advisory Services and they uh, do the fee analysis by zip code. So a doctor also gets a copy of that disc uh, delivered to their practice and that will have the fees that are in their zip code. So they can they can feel good to know that, that the increases that they make are, are going to be not, not off the wall for where they are. Well, Linda, I can't say enough. Thank you so much for joining me today on A Cup of Joe with Binko. And I look forward to seeing everyone next time. Now, I want to end it with this. If you are interested in finding out more about how you can do a revenue analysis consultation in your practice, all you need to do is email me at practicecoaching at binko.com. Again, that's practicecoaching at binko.com. And we'll get you hooked up with Linda and get that scheduled for you. Thank you so much, Linda. Thank you, Kay. Nice to see you. See you next time on a cup of joe. For sure. Bye-bye. Bye.